By default, Windows 11 automatically configures virtual memory settings, but you can customize them if you need to. To do so, click on the Start button and go to Settings. In the left column, System should already be highlighted. To the right, at the bottom, click on About. And below the Device Specifications box, click Advanced System Settings. A System Properties window will open, and you'll see a section called Performance. Click the Settings button beneath it, and on the next window, click the Advanced button at the top. At the bottom of this window, you'll see Virtual Memory. Click on Change. By default, there is a checkbox at the top next to Automatically Manage Paging File Size for All Drives. And if you look at the bottom of the window, you can see the current page file settings. If you want to change this, just uncheck the box at the top of the window. Below this, you can see the drive that your page file is currently stored on. If you have more than one drive and you want to change the page file location, you can do that here. Further down, you can see that the page file is currently set to System Manage Size. Click Custom Size, and a few options will open up. You'll need to set the initial size that you want your page file to be in megabytes. I'll do 2048. You also need to set the maximum size in megabytes that your page file can grow to. I'll do 8192. Once you're happy with your settings, click Set and then click OK at the bottom. It'll let you know that you'll need to restart your computer for the changes to take effect. Click OK. In the Performance Options window, click Apply, and then click OK. And in the System Properties window, click OK again. You'll be asked if you want to restart your computer. Click Restart Now. After your computer loads back into Windows, your virtual memory settings will take effect. If you go back to the virtual memory settings window that we were in before, you can see your new settings and how much virtual memory is currently allocated at the bottom. If you ever want to switch back to letting Windows handle the page file size automatically, just click System Manage Size and then click Set. Click OK and you'll be reminded that you'll need to restart your computer again for the changes to take effect. Click OK, then click Apply. Click OK again, and click OK one final time. When it asks if you want to restart your computer, click Restart Now. Once your computer restarts and loads back into Windows, the virtual memory settings will be managed automatically again. If you have any questions, you can always visit the Acer community or our Acer support site, and don't forget to subscribe.